Okay. Yesterday we went to go buy Faith a fish and a Frankie a fish. So I saw some at this little like bargain 99 cent store that I felt bad for because they were like the fighting fish. They were in a tiny bit of water. I feel like we should go here just to kind of rescue these fish. There was six fish and then they had about 15 other fish that looked like fresh, like they just got there. Like imagine the cups that they're already in and like one of them had this much water in it so you couldn't even swim around and then like most of them just had this much. It, just enough to fill up their bodies. And it was covered in poop. So we bought two of those fish. <laughs> so we brought the fish home and they're completely happy in their tank. But we have not been able to stop thinking about the four fish that we left behind. I asked my husband if it would be okay if I brought them home. You know, the thing about those fish is you're not able to put them all in one tank. That'd be great because then we could just buy one big tank and have them all together. But they fight. So they have to be in separate tanks. So we are going to buy separate tanks and I guess we're gonna have six fish tanks. We're on our way to go save these fish. So we're here. I'm gonna try and like record as much as I can. The quality of the camera, like I'm not gonna be talking. I think it's probably gonna be really crappy, but it's only because these people, they really watch you like everywhere you go. Like they really keep an eye on you, so. And also yeah. the fishes are right in front of the camera. Yeah, so. yeah, so it's gonna be a little tricky, but what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna close my camera like this and we just gonna go inside. <laughs> Okay guys, so she literally put the fish inside of a damn bag. They added more water. Yeah, they added more water yesterday, but the water is still it's like, so foggy. look at that. This is how these fish are living. And literally you guys, I cannot make it up. The water was less than halfway and the fish were just like, I think maybe they heard us saying something, Faith, and that's why they added more water. So this is one of the fish, you can't even see him. Give me oh one of my, my fish. okay. One this fish. one they put a lot of water in. This is the one that literally had no water, huh, Faith? He couldn't even move his little his little tail around. And Faith wanted this one. You guys can't even see the fish. It's so sad. It's literally so sad. They're swimming in their own poop. Which I know fish do. Like they swim in yeah. their own poop, but But that's too extreme. He seems to have the cleanest water, huh? Yeah. Look at him. Oh my god, you guys. And this one has a least. Give me this okay. one. Like, my fish is so hungry. Like, every time I feed them, which it says, like, in the instructions to only feed them three times a day, like... Three times a day? That's a lot. But for it's a only, fish. like, three little pellets. Oh. And the pellets are so small. Oh, my so, God, you guys. And, and he, like, every time I feed him, he eats them right away. He never has leftovers. And my, my fish saved one pellet. Okay, guys. So, what we're going to do is we are gonna get these little guys home and get them in a comfortable tank and yeah give them a better life and i guess now we have recording? seven fish tanks it's gonna be a lot of work but you know what you guys we have to save the animals like literally we have to do everything we can you guys you guys you don't even know the life you're gonna have little girl i hate that people sell beta fish because like when they transport them they would literally put them in tiny plastic bags. Like they sell them, at, like they're selling them at the fair and they just throw them all together like in a truck and ship them. Like once they get there, that's when they put them inside of the, this little tiny thing. I feel so bad for buying them because we're technically still supporting the business and they're like, okay, well, people are buying them so we're still gonna purchase them and we're still making money off of it. But hmm. like with these, like, I, I just feel so bad for them because they're like dying. Anyway, we're gonna go get these guys in a comfortable home now. Right now I'm adding spring water that they're gonna be swimming in. So that way they can adapt to it a little bit for like 10 minutes so that way they don't go into shock. So she's already added water there and look how they're already swimming to the top. Poor things, huh, Faithy? Yeah. Like they're dead fish. What the, what the hell will you give them a little bit of water? That's literally their damn air. So Faith is washing the gravel using my kitchen stuff and then she's putting it inside. How are we going to have six fish, Faith? Are you going to be in charge of cleaning the tanks? 
Obviously. Don't worry, little guys. You're going to be nice and safe right now, okay? Now I'm going to add the water to each one. Um, I don't know if this will take the whole thing. And I don't know the gravel is going to fly all over the place, but that's fine. And again, this is spring water. If you get spring water, instead of using tap water, then you don't have to like buy any chemicals to put inside of it so that way it's purified. Like to condition it. Yeah, and then the spring water already has all the vitamins that they need. Oh, it plopped a little bit. Almost, guys. Okay, so now that they are all froze up, Faith is rinsing these. They look so good, you guys. Like, oh my goodness, this is his first time having space. This is my fish. Her name is Zuru, and we named her after Zuru Toys because I love mini brands so much. You guys, look at her. I hope she makes it. When we went yesterday, she had the least amount of water. Yeah. And she like she looked like she was gonna die. Like she looked sick. Faith felt so guilty for not buying her. But we went back today and bought her. Oh my goodness. She's so confused. All of her poop water went in there, it's fine. Yeah, it'll sink and it's just good for them to have some of their bacteria in here so again, they don't go into shock. <gasps> Oh my goodness! She's so pretty. Look at how her tail is, is so pretty. Oh my god, it like almost glows. Yeah, it looks like it's like like holographic. Is this what it's called? Oh my goodness. <gasps> Look at her, you guys. I don't think she's ever stretched out her tail. She looks so happy. She looks happy already. Okay, so Alyssa's setting up lighting so we can show you guys the fish. Yes. This is just kind of taking a long time. I was posting on Instagram, okay? Okay guys, the lighting's crazy. But the craziest thing about having so many fish is I can't tell like, is Alyssa fishy like normal Shut or- Shut up! For, you're so mean. Or is it the fish? I'm kidding, I'm kidding. <laughs> or am I? It's been 24 hours since we put the fish inside of their tanks. We wanted to see how they were gonna adjust and literally you guys, they are doing so good. Look, this is the one we were like the most worried about. Where is he at? He keeps hiding. Just because he keeps floating to the top. And, and he's really small. Yeah, he's really small. Like, his tail's kind of falling apart. Like, it's really sad. So we don't know how he's going to do. The girls were kind of bummed out that he might not make it. But I told the girls, like, at least the rest of his life he had freedom. You know, even though these tanks are really small, for them, it's a lot better than swimming in water like this. This is my little Zuru right here. She is the one that was in the worst condition and she seems to be doing really good. She like so she happy, loves, huh? yeah, she loves to hide in her plants. I might like separate the plants just so she can hide better. And then there's this guy. He's also really small, but again, he looks to be doing so much better. Like these two are doing so good. Oh, there she is. And, but this little guy, I'm so worried about him. This is the fourth one. This one was in the best condition, you guys. When we first saw him, we could not even like see how beautiful his fins are. But he seems to be doing good. He looks so, like a mermaid, huh? Makes me super happy. This is Faith's fish. The water's already getting a little cloudy. Like, I think you have to change the water every week. If you guys know, let me know in the comments. But he seems to be doing really good. Okay, and then there's Enrique's fish doing... He looks like his last super one. Super good. So yeah, guys, we have six fish now. Like, literally, we have six fish. Six fish tanks. My dad said, that, like, we're becoming a damn zoo because how many pets we're damn have. Yeah. We have the six fish. We have Roxy. We have our little kitty cat. And we have Esteban. That's not even that bad. Like, if it was up to me, I'd have ten cats. Am I? I just do, Alyssa. Anyways. Can you guys believe we have six fish? All right. Now it's time for shout out of the day. Da, 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 da. No one likes when you sing, they told me. Take They're like, my favorite part of the vlog is when you sing. Oh, by the way, by the way, before we get to shout out of the day, I just want to let you guys know that, okay, I just want to let you guys know, wait, Alyssa, I just want to let you guys know that we have a lot of mini brand stuff coming up this week, so if you guys are bummed that we had no mini brands in this video, I'm sorry, but I just really wanted to spread awareness about these fish. Like, that was my goal. That's why I was like, I need to make this into a video. So yeah, um, now it's time for shout out of the day. Shout out of the day! Take yourself away with shout out of the day. Hey. Doesn't so it get you mad that I 
get you every time. You don't get me. You're just Cover crazy. your hair because then they're going to see that that room over there is dirty and this room's clean just for the vlog. <laughs> Shout out of the day goes to It's Carmen's Vlog. I have been wanting to give her a shout out for so long. I love you guys so much. Deuces dailies. Deuces dailies. Imagine waking up to this.